Welcome to the 2014 CrossFit Fort Vancouver Invitational. Event 3 is called Snatch Relay, and it will involve snatches and wall ball burpees. The movement standard for the snatches will be the same as CrossFit Open 13.1. You may power snatch or you may squat snatch. The wall ball burpees are a combination of wall balls and burpees. This video will deal with the many particular rules of the wall ball burpees and also the snatch portion of this event. There are three criteria for a good rep on the wall ball burpees. Ball in hand, hip crease below the knee, ball hits the target, and chest to deck. Here's what it looks like when a few good reps are done in a row. A good rep starts with the ball in hand, hip crease below the knee, at which point the ball will go up and hit the target and then the chest will hit the deck. That's when a good rep is counted. Regardless if the attempt is a good rep or a failed rep, the team must alternate attempts with each other. In the event that one teammate has completed all of their reps and the other has not, the incomplete teammate must complete all of their reps before the team can leave the wall ball burpee station. The teammate that has already completed their reps may assist by catching the ball and passing the ball to their teammate who will then complete all of their reps. Both teammates must remain at the wall ball burpee station until all reps for the team are complete. There are four snatch stations in this event. Each athlete must complete two stations. Athlete one must complete station one and station three. Athlete two must complete station two and station four. Although there are four snatch stations in this workout, there is only one barbell per team. The team must advance the barbell from one station to the next and adjust the weights to the correct weight for that station. When the barbell is advanced from station to station, it must be moved in parallel to the lanes for safety purposes on the competition floor. As long as the athlete performs a snatch according to the same standards as CrossFit Open 13.1 and ends up with both feet on the station's mat, then it is considered a good rep. Even if the athlete were to step off the mat during the attempt and able to recover balance and step back onto the mat with a bar locked overhead, it is still considered a good rep. Each snatch repetition must start with the weights touching the competition floor off of the station's mat. Time stops after both teammates step on the finish mat with both of their feet. 